Hi everybody, it's Michelle and today we're going to be making a little clothespin flower pot. That's a cute little way to give flowers as a gift for Mother's Day or whatever occasion you would like. First you're going to need a small potted flower. I got a four inch here of the viola. Then you're going to need 19 clothespins, a regular tuna can with the lid removed and then that just washed out. And then you're going to need a jiffy pot. Those did not list a size or anything. The package just says jiffy pots three. There were 12 of those in a pack for under two dollars so very inexpensive way to make your flower gift a little prettier okay to get started the first thing you want to do is repot your flower into the jiffy pot I'll lay down some napkins here so we can do that We want to put that in the jiffy pot so that that's going to be biodegradable and whoever you're giving the gift to can just plant that straight into the ground like that. Okay, once you have that repotted, we're just going to sit that straight down in the center of our tuna can. <clears throat> I'm just using my tuna can as is. You could paint it if you wanted to, but it's going to be mostly hidden with the clothespins, so I'm just going to leave it the way it is. Okay. Now we're going to leave that, we're going to start with it in there to begin with because it's going to get kind of tight when we get the clothespins around it so that way we won't have to squeeze it in. See how that kind of shoved it aside. So we're going to work evenly on either side to get those on there. can kind of get it shifted toward the center pretty well before it starts getting really tight because it will be hard to move it when they all get in there it'll be very tight okay now that you've got your four going around that's got a pretty good balance so we're just going to start filling in. That's already getting pretty tight, so I'm going to switch it around to the opposite side.
may have to squeeze it a little to get that to go in there. that puckered in there. It's really going to be in there good when we get them all in. You know, actually I think that could have used 20. Okay, so that was actually 20 closed pins all the way around. You can just go back and adjust it. like a little picket fence. So there's what it looks like when it's all done. Very easy, very quick. I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe, give me a like over on Facebook, and follow me on Pinterest. Thanks for watching. See you next time.